Okay, in this video I'm going to show you GPU benchmarking, which is uh, video card benchmarking, and my favorite benchmark of choice is Furmark. Uh, it's available at geeks3d.com or ozone3d.net, and I'll post the links in the info. And also, uh, my GPU monitoring tool is GPU-Z, available at techpowerup.com. And so, um, I'm going to run the benchmark, and it'll assign me a score according to how well my hardware performs, and then I can compare that score uh, with other people's scores from around the world to see how my hardware compares to theirs. So, I'll run it now, and you'll notice that my GPU temperature will start to steadily increase as... Uh, as Furmark is running. So, here we go. So it's already it's already shot up to 79 degrees. And Furmark shows the min uh, frames per second, the average, and the maximum. So it's already gone up 10 degrees since I started running this program. It's just been running for about 30 seconds. Okay, so once Furmark finishes the benchmark, which ran for 60 seconds, it gives you a score. Mine's 1705, which is really terrible, uh, mainly because I'm running this screen recording software and I'm uh, using old hardware and an old CPU. Uh, but my GPU reached a maximum temperature of 87 degrees. Uh, to give you a reference, some people are achieving scores over 60,000, so 1,700 is pretty bad. But it also gives you information about uh, your system and everything else. So I'll post the links on where you can find this software, uh, how you can run it, and compare your scores with with other people from the, around the world. And as you can see, my uh, GPU temperature is starting to go back down since the benchmark is no longer running. Uh, and so that's GPU benchmarking. If you have any questions, you can leave me a comment or check out the blog at Gaslamp Computers.